In today's lesson, I'm going to show you how to introduce writing numbers in um, base 10. So numbers in the all the way up to the thousands. So I have this grid paper and it's labeled thousands, hundreds, tens, and ones. And this can be used with base 10 blocks, golden beads. It can be used with the stamp game and it can also be used with number cards. So the purpose is to um, help children understand writing um, numbers in standard form and what the um, quantities are. So let's start with an example of um, using the concrete material. So I might set out an amount And then ask the child, how much is this? 331. And then we'll record that. Three hundreds, three tens, one one. 331. The same could also be done with the um, stamp game. So I could set out a certain amount. and say, how much is this? Three thousand, zero hundreds, two tens, five ones. And then to record it, we write three in the thousands place, zero hundreds, two tens, <clears throat> and five ones. So our number is three, sa three <laughs> excuse me, three thousand twenty-five. And I do have, I should mention, there are um, these little disks represent zero. Um, they're optional. I, I don't always use them, but um, if there is a zero in any particular place value, that's what you would use to represent that. It's just sort of a placeholder. Okay. Now um, you can also use this grid paper to write numbers um, with the number cards. So for example, uh, let's say I laid out this number. So this is an expand, expanded form, and you can ask your students to record it or write it in standard form. Okay, so I have 100, 6 tens, 6 ones, and then we can check it. 166. Okay. Um, you can also have um, uh, students do combinations of um, making the numbers with the blocks, with the number cards, um, and then recording it, or the um, stamp game and the number cards and recording it. All right, and that is how to use the grid paper to help students write numbers in base 10.